Can, so, can you make your eyes go cross-eyed? So, Try it. No, just do one. No, now you're just looking over. <laughs> I, can't do I, can't, I can't see the screen when I do it. Does it do just one? No. How about now? Almost. <laughs> <laughs> your eye gets permanent like that. <laughs> oh, what's up, guys? What's up? So, what's up, guys? What's up? You remember this? This is what my wife threw at me yesterday. <laughs> Showed her what's up. Oh, fuck now she's my gonna life. Make my lunch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's just sitting there. She's plotting. <laughs> yeah. She's plotting. She's looking at me. So this is awkward. <laughs> Ricky, move back there and shield me. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, fuck. I feel safe over here. Look, man. Jack and Jill went up the hill so Jack could lick her candy, but Jack got a shock and a mouthful of cock. Because <laughs> Jill's real name is Randy. <laughs> that was close. <laughs> Fuck. Why don't you just shut the hell up and get over here and unzip these fucking pants? You're wearing sweats. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> 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 Alright, guys. I'm afraid she's gonna throw something else at me. <laughs> Fuck. Dude, yeah, Ruby, volume Ruby, two. volume two, chapter, chapter two, chapter two, chapter so dose. volume two, chapter dose. Welcome to the beacon of hope. It's actually just welcome to the beacon. Welcome to the beacon. Let's do this. <laughs> Trying to make a beat there. Damn right. <laughs> Jesus. Why did they change the beginning? That's the There's a point where it dips, is a point where it breaks, oh. is a point where it sends, and a point where you just can't say. That's dope as hell. Practice, buddy? Yeah. I already can, I just. I just need to get in like See, I can already do all this, I just don't want to make you jokes. <laughs> so I choose not to, you know? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? I thought I was going to nut shot him. I have my camera gear right there too, so I'm probably going to cut it off. Give me an application. It's too small to be cut off. This is a quick bag and I'm holding my gear with it. It's just resting on the balls. There's nothing actually there. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. That was Ricky. Oh, yeah. Ironwood oh <laughs> certainly loves bringing his work wherever he travels. Well, running an academy in a military makes him a busy man. But yes, those are a bit of an eyesore. This flies down, crashes into the building. Come in. Ospin. Hello, General. Please, Dr. Formalis. <laughs> it's been too long. And Glinda. It has certainly been too long since we last met. Oh, James. I'll be outside. Hmm? No. Well, she hasn't changed a bit. So, what in the world has brought you all the way down from the Atlas? Headmasters don't typically travel with their students for the Vital Festival? Well, you know how much I love Vale this time of year. Besides, with oh. you hosting? Yeah, it throws us all a good opportunity for us to... I can certainly appreciate quality time between friends. However, a small fleet outside my window has me somewhat concerned. Well, concern is what brought them here. I understand travel between kingdoms has become increasingly difficult. Oz, you and I both know why I brought those men. He's like, dude, you, you got something in your eyebrow. You're trying to be Nelly there? We're in a time of peace. Shows of power like this 
I'm just going to give off the wrong impression. But if what Crow said is true, then... If what Crow said is true, then we will handle it tactfully. It's the vital festival. A time to celebrate unity and peace. So I suggest you not scare people by transporting hundreds of soldiers halfway across the continent. I'm just being cautious. As Rips am I. Which is just why we will smoking. continue to train the best huntsmen and huntresses we can. Believe me, I am. But ask yourself this. Do you honestly believe your children can win a war? Yeah. <laughs> I hope they never have to. But they could. Cause they got Ruby. Natural born leader. By who? Your mother? Me and Pira. Hello again. <laughs> Come on, let me play your hand for a turn. I'm not trusting you with the good citizens of Vacuo. Why not? You've trusted me with way more important stuff before. I mean, you told us all that Blake is secretly a fun loving person whom we all admire and respect. Great. <laughs> <laughs> that. Ladies, enjoy your battle. Sup, losers? Hey, son. Ruby, Yang, Blake, Ice Queen. Why does everyone keep calling me that? I never got a chance to formally introduce you to my old friend. Uh, aren't libraries for reading? Thank you. Pancakes! Shut up. Pancakes. Okay, no. <laughs> Intellectual, okay? Thank you. I'm Neptune. So, Neptune, where are you from? Haven. And I don't believe I've caught your name, Snow Angel. Um, I'm white. <laughs> are you kidding me? Pleasure to meet you. I never took you as the board game playing type. Right. Well, I think I'm done playing, actually. I'll see you guys later. Women. <laughs> Brothers of the White Fang, why are you aiding this skull? The White Fang and I are going in on a joint business venture together. <laughs> well, this has certainly been an eventful evening. 
I'm sure that after a night of thwarting attempted robbery, you probably just want to go home and take a nap. But I was hoping that maybe we could have a chance to talk. Of course. Wonderful. As you know, in order to enroll in my academy, students must first pass a rigorous entrance exam. Most applicants spend years of preparation training at one of the many combat schools around the world. You are one of the few who did not. And you pass the exam with flying colors. I was raised outside the kingdoms. If you can't fight, you can't survive. Well, you have most certainly survived, Blake. I admire your drive. And I am proud to run a school that accepts individuals from all walks of life. Rich, poor, human. Stupid, retarded. Faunus. Why do you wear that bow, Blake? Why hide who you are? You may be willing to accept the Faunus, Professor Ospin, but your species is not. True. But we are continuing to take strides to lessen the divide. With all due respect, you need to start taking some larger strides. Until then, I'd rather avoid any unnecessary attention. I want people to see me for who I am, not what I am. And what are you? An evil bitch. I don't understand what you're asking. <laughs> How did you know the White Fang would be at the shipyard tonight? I didn't. I just happened to be at the right place at the right time. You wouldn't have been the first. But what happened tonight was not an isolated incident. I may be your headmaster, but I am also a huntsman. And it is my sworn duty to protect this world from the forces that conspire against it. Uh. Blake. Sorry. Are you oh. sure there is nothing else you would like to tell me? I'm sure. <laughs> God. Very well. Oh, man. Thank you for your time, Ms. Oh, that was awesome. If you ever need to talk to me, please don't hesitate to ask. I'll be in my dorm room. I'll be oh, awake at around 11 never let him play. <laughs> You're just mad because the new guy beat you. See, if you had just attacked when I told you, none of this would have happened. Stop. Lately, you've been quiet, antisocial, and moody. Uh, have you met Blake? Which I get is kind of your thing, but you've been doing it more than usual which, quite frankly, is unacceptable. You made a promise to me, to all of us, that you would let us know if something was wrong. So, Lake Belladonna, what is wrong? What the f- <laughs> She has issues. <laughs> I just, I don't understand how everyone can be so calm. You're still thinking about Torchwick? Torchwick, the White Fang, all of it. Something big is happening and no one is doing anything about it. Ospin told us not to worry. Between the police and the huntsmen, I'm sure they could handle it. Well, I'm not. They don't know the White Fang like I do. Okay, between blowing up nightclubs, <laughs> oh, stopping thieves, and mosquito. fighting for freedom, yeah. I'm sure the three of you think you're all ready to go out and apprehend these ne'er-do-wells. Uh, who? But let me once again be the voice of reason. We're students. We're not ready to handle this sort of situation. Well, yeah, but <laughs> we're not ready. And we may never be ready. Our enemies aren't just gonna sit around and wait for graduation day. They're out there somewhere planning their next move and none of us know what it is, but it's coming. Whether we're ready or not. Okay. That's what he All said. All in favor of becoming the youngest hunter sister single-handedly bring down a corrupt organization conspiring against the kingdom of Vale. Say I. Yes! I love it when you're feisty. Well, I suppose it could be fun. None of you said I. All right, then. <laughs> We're in this together. <laughs> Let's hatch a plan. Yeah! Ooh, seriously, <gasps> fuck off. Oh. <laughs> I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Are, are you okay? I'm fine. Just watch where you're going. Oh, <laughs> right. Sorry. Um, I'm Ruby. Are you new? Visiting from Haven, actually. How oh, brutal. Ooh, you're here for the festival. Oh, nope, but it's she's she's inside their own dormitory. I guess we just got turned around. <laughs> Don't worry, happens all the time. Uh, your building is just east of here. Thanks. Maybe we'll see you around. Yeah, maybe. Oh, uh, and welcome to Begin.
So as you can see, Ricky got mad and threw his empty can at me. So yeah, I wonder why. Farted in his face more than once, like three times, when his mouth was open. <laughs> Why am I still with you? <laughs> like, really? I, I don't know. Because I'm fucking amazing. No, you're not. Well, then why why are you here? Because I like, Cause I like to I fucking... I want our children to be happy. <laughs> <laughs> I threw a crayon at you, bitch. <laughs> Holy. Ricky, where are you? He's in the bathroom trying to... So, did you watch that, babe? Did you like it? Uh, how the fuck did she get into the school? Why are you asking me? I'd ask Ricky, but he peaced out. Like a bitch. That thing is a beast. I want to know how that chick got in the school. Seriously, this moth is going to eat me. And uh, if she's in the school with those two, if that moth eats me, they're in trouble. I'm in trouble. <laughs> Seriously though, that one chick you saw with like the fiery eyes, she's evil as fuck. She's got crazy. Oh, there's Ricky. <laughs> there he is. So the ending of that video you didn't see, he's walked away like a bitch. Um, Ruby was walking down the hall and those that evil chick, what's her name? Oh, she looks... Uh, so Cinder. She, Cinder? Yeah. Yeah, she was there. How did she get into school? She's an enemy. <laughs> oh man, they're in trouble then. Oh yeah. Fuck. Whatever. They like, I honestly don't know. They probably... Well, John, John's able to sneak his way into Beacon. I'm yeah. pretty sure anyone can. That's true. Uh, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what happens now. Yeah. Because that was a bit of a cliffhanger, right? Oh, like, yeah. It's like, holy fuck, you know? Ruby's like, oh, welcome to Beacon. <laughs> and that chick's like, I'm going to murder you when you sleep. Yeah. You know, like, fuck. Well, I, I don't know where this is going, but I hope I hope those guys kick the shit out of Cinder. But she's pretty evil. We'll see. She's pretty hot. I'm just saying, like, you know, like... You know, she may well, be a pixelated character, but I'd get that I'd put that. it right in there. Hell yeah. Put it right in those pixels. Fucking well, never know. Call Maybe it sometime pixel in dick. the future they'll create a <laughs> thing that you can make pixelated dicks and fucking animate Carol. That'd be fucking awesome. They're gonna have one of those things and you're like <laughs> beep and it's like <laughs> what would you like today, sir? Fucking blowjob. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure the Japanese already came up with that. Yeah, probably. I think they did, yeah. Something like it. I know it's an Archer TV it's series I watched. Well, we hope you guys enjoyed. Um, that was a really good episode. Cause I like where it led up to. No, I like it. Um, I'm very excited to see what the fuck happens next. I, wanna, I hope there's a big all-out war. 